and Jack Ladd, they used to hang out together all the time, and they carved their names into this bench on a school trip once. You don't care, do you? No, please, keep going. Okay, on another school trip, they- Stop. Oh! What the heck? 
Do, do, don't, don't, okay? Just don't move, okay? Don't come anywhere near me. No, no. Just don't move. What is it? What's wrong? This night has turned banana bread really fast, and I'm seeing things and forgetting things, and I bumped into you once already. And it was horrible, so... What are you talking about? Back at the beach? I'm talking about the Alex I saw at the pier. After the cave looked like the freaking 4th of July, and I lost track of everybody. Nona, believe me, that wasn't us. I don't know that yet. So, just look. You're not gonna talk about my grandfather. You're just gonna stand there, politely, and tell me if you've seen Clarissa. Because uh... I've been looking. Clarissa's at... No, no, we haven't. But we, uh, we're actually, we're looking for Ren right now. So, have you, have you maybe seen him? No, not Ren. Okay, well... Hey, listen, Nona. You should come with us. That way... Don't come near me. Come on, Alex. Just back away. Nona, it's me, Alex. Remember? Can you just... Can you go to the comm tower and wait for us? We got the lights on there, and... It seems pretty safe. No, Nona, you should really come with us. It's better to stick together. Better for who? Nona, come on. For everyone, for all of us. No. <sighs> and the comm tower is where? It's the cloud buster at the edge of town. Can't miss it. And you. You're really you? Really? Yeah, Nona, it's me, Alex. All right, bye. Girls a peach. No, what the? Could I have said something different to make her come with me? I don't know what I could have said or what I could have done to change that. There's the devil again. Maybe it's my brother. Oh, I guess it would make s this shouldn't be the devil. Hey, just for me, I want to know. Back at the bridge, why'd you flip the switch yourself? You could have let me do it. I'm just oh, to impress you, of course. Why would I do anything except to delicately enhance your opinion of me? <laughs> okay, all right. Okay, that must be the way station. And actually, help me understand, why would an island need anything like that anyway? Like, nobody's going anywhere. Doesn't the whole thing just go in a circle? Um, this was a, a mining island before the war. And the land, you know, as you can tell, it wasn't really conducive to most different ways of transport, so they dug into the hills and laid down tracks and carted the coal by freight to the, um, the pier. For the boats. Can I ask you something? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, of course. You think I'm kind of a slacker idiot, right? Like, I wouldn't find any of this stuff interesting? <laughs> Jonas, I think you're smart. Come on, what are you talking about? Hmm, I don't know. I just sometimes get these, like, whiffs of... I don't know. Mean to be like I that. can't think of the word for it. Superiority? No, not that. It's like, I don't know. Nah, it'll come to me. Hmm. I don't, I'm not trying to be like that. I'm sorry if I'm It does seem like it wants my character, to, like the, some of the options it's giving me. It's like. That makes me want to do it, but like it's giving me options that would lead to that thought. Huh. Oh, I well. think I remember reading that this well is supposed to be the first thing ever um, built or whatever on the island back in the 1600s. It doesn't have a sign or anything. It uh, used to, I think. Uh, 
Uh, every, like, option I have, I feel like, you know, lead to a different outcome. You know, I don't know, like, I don't know how specific it is. I doubt it's that specific. But, you know. The engine's on the other side, but let me check up here real quick. What is this? Why is this right end up here? Guys, Whoa. Jesus, it took you forever to get here. What happened? I've been scared out of my mind. Hearing things, seeing things. We went to Milner first. Clarissa was having a slow motion conniption, and I don't know, it just seemed more pressing. Oh my God, Clarissa can handle herself. I'm the one that needed a babysitter until I was 14. Do you have, like, any idea what's going on? Nope. Oh, okay, no. that must be the way station, and... Actually, help me understand, no. why would an island need anything like that anyway? No, no, no. Ugh, Jonas, we're repeating the same stuff again. We are? Ugh, oh, it's kind of weird that you can tell when it's happening and I can't, right? I mean, it's not like... I mean, I'm glad someone can tell, but... It's just strange. Yeah, but what... What's happening here? What, what's There's wrong? your boy. Hey, Ren! We made it, finally! Um, Ren? No, 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 no. Ren! Is he in shock or something? Don't, don't, do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Yeah, I don't know. No, I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna block him. I cannot jump off the side of that thing. I saw it. That's not happening again. No way in hell am I letting it happen. No one else is gonna jump. But what's he doing? Is he like sleepwalking? I don't know how he like fell asleep during all this. I've seen sleepwalking, okay? Michael, Ren, are you in there? Come on, pal, the neighbors are here and they want to borrow some sugar. This isn't a guy on drugs. Not that I want to like alarm you. Ren! I hope you have a plan B. But the last time we got stuck, we used one of these things to get out of it. So I'm not just messing around right now. Yeah, I remember. I remember. Kind of. Where'd Ren go? He was standing right there. I thought, I thought this would have fixed it, like last time, didn't it? The time stuff? Yeah, I mean, I think, I, I think it did. I don't feel as foggy. Must have used this to call us. Oh, it looks smashed. Is he over here? Please don't say he's over here. Um, oh, no, he is. Crap. I don't. Maybe we shouldn't um, go near him. Ren, can you. Can you hear me? I mean, I know they say don't move somebody with a spine injury, but it's like. We gotta do something. Right? Uh, this is a little different than a trampoline accident. He's, like, turning into the star child. I know, it's different. I know it's different. I'm just saying we should do something. I don't know what, but something. 
left in Medulla and then uh, the wind came from up and I started hiding in the grass and then to peel off. Ren, are, are you... Oh, God. Talk through, child. Feels. Stretched. Better. No. What are you? In between. Fastened. Loose. Rounded. But do not be stirred. Our dolls would never plot hurt you. Can not hurt you. Can you help us? We're we're stuck here and we just want to go home. Home. Kamina. We will go home. All of us. Leave. Possible. I, I... I don't know what you mean, so I can't... Grounded. By... Adler. So, uh, Margaret. Pretty. Little. Poppy. Peggy Adler. That old woman? What does she have to do with anything? That old woman was... Young. Once. Young. Once. Sit. Still. Bear. Fruit. Tag. No, no. Yeah. Ah! Ah! Holy mother of God. You guys. God, Ren. Man. You're alive. I am. I am! Well, why was that a question at first? Why? Why is this... Why? Actually, thanks for coming, by the way. <laughs> sure. Why is this happening? I mean, I've been here. I visited this place like 15 times. We're in big trouble, Ren. Really big trouble. We need to call somebody or get a boat, but we need to get out of here. It's ghosts. She doesn't want to say it, but it's ghosts. And you were possessed by one. <sighs> that doesn't... <laughs> that doesn't seem like it'd be part of a healthy no, lifestyle. Like it would. God, does anyone... Is this thing working? If no. anyone can hear this, out there, in a... whatever. I, I'm at the comm tower on Edwards Island. Hey, she listened to us. Great. So, if anyone can... What is this? I, I'm trying to communicate with the... Does she know how to even work that stuff? Doesn't sound like it. <sighs> We should get back there before she freaks out and runs away again. I think that was our cue then. It's kind of a shortcut back to the communication tower if we go through this fence. What fence? Shouldn't take that long. What? You made us walk all the... We had to take a goddamn moving bridge thing to get here, and all you had to do was go through a fence to get to the comm tower? I didn't want to leave. I was scared. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ugh. That's the that's the thing I was looking at earlier. Okay. They uh, they're acting way too normal about this. I can't say that enough, really. Because yeah, it's just not it's not a normal situation, and they're treating it like it is. 
joking around and stuff. I mean, I guess that's how you can deal with the, I would call this trauma. Yeah, because this is some crazy-ish right here. Crazy shit is going down. I can't imagine what I would do in this situation, but I imagine I would be like freaked out a lot more than they were are currently. Like all the time. Like the whole the whole time. Man, you know what just jumped into my head just completely randomly? That show in the, uh, it was a horse ranch? Or a horse farm, but... Horse ranch show? What? A year ago, out in Salem, we took over a stable and our band played, and you, you ditched that test again, right? To, to bring us a new amp? Because during the sound check, we blew ours. None of this is spark... Uh, sure. I, if I squint, I can kind of remember. What about it? Nothing. I don't know. But I can't believe you didn't tell Jonas this story yet. She had already blown off this, like, super important for school placement aptitude test once, and... Why'd you do that? Um, I think she was... indisposed? Michael had just died, like, a month or two before, and I... I don't know, I just wasn't in the quizzing mood. But, you know, it's... whatever, that's... that's not part of the story. Anyways, she was gonna retake it, and on the day of... I had to emergency call her way out in the... Just picture, like, Little House on the Prairie. I don't know what that is. It's a... Really? You don't know what Little House on the Prairie is? Wait, you blew off an important test to get him an amp? Really? That was a thing you did? Well, yeah. I mean, maybe I would have done things differently now, but... You know, whatever. And the funny part is, I'd taken that same test after dosing a bunch of cough medicine and I still aced it, so she would have blown it out of the water. And even knowing that, she still came out to help me. Well, you failed to tell me that part. Maybe that's why this is a more meaningful memory to me than you. Yeah, I think I'm with Alex on this one. She probably should have stuck around and taken that test. Really? Even if at the time she didn't care? How come? Listen, it's just, like, if I was good at what you guys are good at, which is being smart... What about it? I wouldn't waste one of my few remaining test days on a show in a barn. Hmm. No offense. Hey, none taken. I'm not that smart, Jonas. There's nothing really to waste here. Yeah, I don't want to make yeah, if you say so. bad, you know? He already feels like I think he's dumb for some reason. I didn't want to halt conversation by going into the next zone, so I wanted to finish that convo up. She's adorable, isn't she? Ugh. My god, is this what I sound yeah, like? Yeah, those cheeks are just made for pinching. How can anyone yeah, stand and listen she is. to me all day? And, uh, so give my lungs a breather. My stupid chest's on fire for some reason. That's not good. Smoke will do that. Yes, it will. Actually, 
I'm gonna stop talking since this obviously isn't working. So just come on up and you can help or something. God, this stupid thing. She doesn't sound good, right? She sounds a little off. I don't know her well enough. She's just tired, Ren. We're all tired. I mean, hell, I would have been tired by now if all we'd been doing was drinking and laying on the beach. Yeah, I, yeah, I guess. Just, I'm so glad I took that second brownie. What? It's kind of, you know... Wait, second brownie? Ren, please tell me this is a joke, okay? This is a joke, right? Mm, why would this be a joke? I'm not joking. Wait, you're not messing with us? You seriously took another one? It was like, it was like half of one, all right? It's just to level me out. It'll, it'll bring me back up. That's what it does. You better pray to whatever God scares you the most. It does level you out, because if this screws us up, you're on summary probation. Don't say that. That's not, that's not nice. Oh, God. This thing doesn't work. Not getting anything? I'm getting something, but it's like, I don't know. Hey, Nona. Night's still going, huh? We heard you on the uh, speaker system. You got that working? That's about all I got working. Uh, sorry I was like, weird earlier. But, hey, have you figured out what's going on yet? You have to know something. It's been ghosts. Nona, ghosts are going on. The blackouts, the hallucinations, it's all been ghosts. Ghosts? Really? Yeah, and it would really help if you could just jump to the believing us part. It would save a headache. Oh! Oh, I got it! This is great! This is perfect! I know exactly what to do. Do you? Yeah, totally! It's Maggie Adler. Maggie Adler? Yeah, she has a boat. Had a boat. I mean, the boat's still here, but... Her house, manor, or whatever it is, is behind a huge gate. You can see it coming up here from Main Street. No, I know, but the keys to it are here, somewhat readily available. What? My sister, Allie, worked at the park's office in town. She had to deliver that old woman her mail every day. I know that they have the key. Okay, so... No, 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 we are not. We are not gonna go with the plan. The first plan put forth by the group's resident, Burnout. Hey, come on. I'm not a burnout. Okay, so I ate like two brownies. Yeah, and well, what... and I'm not saying it's the best plan, but what oh, other plan is there really, Jonas? Oh, I don't know. Fix the radio, find Clarissa, set fire to the mug shop. And these are just off the top of my head. Yeah, I'm still worried about Clarissa. But we don't know where Clarissa is. I'm not saying literally do that, I'm just... There's other things we can do. <laughs> but there isn't. Ren, understand it is completely your fault that we're in this to begin with. What? And now you want us to trust you when things are really bad? Come on, Jonas, this is nobody's fault. Ghosts are never anybody's fault, certainly <laughs> not ours. That's true. Yeah, guys, this isn't really a productive. It should be obvious to even the cheap seats that you're the only new weirdo who throws this whole social harmony thing we got no, going no, on out of whack. No, no. I mean, we all grew up with each other. Okay, Ren, just take a step back, all right? Jonas isn't a weirdo. He's a... he's a good guy. What? Your good guy is like deploying a missile barrage of insanity on me right now. I know you said Ren is like, harmless or whatever, but I'm over giving him passes. And you should be too. I don't need a pass from you. Alex is my best... Okay, you're arguing 15 things at once now. Do the plan, trust Jonas, leave Ren, like, pick a target, or, better yet, just don't. Yeah. Look, I don't care what Caveman Jonas says. <laughs> what there is, is a that? boat at Maggie Adler's house. And the key to her house is back on Main Street. And the backup plan for when this thing fails spectacularly is two of us have to stay here by the semi-functioning walkie-talkie. Fine by me. Alex has the radio. Are you okay to go into town? Not that you... Not, not that you wouldn't be okay. Yeah, it's not like, you know, I'm fine, whatever, I'm ready. She shouldn't, you shouldn't go alone. We don't need like three of us up here. Yeah, I'll totally go. It's my, like, 
brilliant idea or whatever. Are you kidding? Your food is gonna start kicking in any second. Beyond that, you're a completely unreliable basket case. I am not a basket case. You, uh... Me uh stop it! Sorry. Okay, keeping in mind who you've been able to depend on the whole night... Yes, keeping in mind who you're tired of... Keeping in mind who's taller, who do you want coming with you? Nona? Wanna come with me? What? Really? I mean... I guess... Why this are you making me shack up with this guy? It's my friggin' plan! Been together the why? <laughs> this is why! Easiest question I've been asked all night. This is a total punt, Alex. Yeah, this is No, it's fine. This'll be a good... If you don't want to take sides, don't take sides. But no, nobody's happy with this. Uh. Hey, Nona's happy. You're happy, right? Um, sure. I I kind of panicked in the moment, and I just picked Nona. So. Uh. Yeah. Let's further away. I still need you, Jonas, okay? So keep your knee pads on, mentally speaking. I'll see you when you get back, Alex. We're still friends, Ren. If Missy's sixth grade birthday party couldn't split us up, this certainly won't. Good luck with the thing, Alex. Okay, now that that situation might be messed up. Uh, I wonder what would have happened if I said nothing. I, I should have probably picked Jonas because I'm sure he actually wanted to be with Zarya. So no. Um, he probably would have. Ren probably would have wanted to hang out with Nona. Like he couldn't have said that. I would think, but I don't actually know. I don't know why I chose Nona. Nona didn't trust me in the beginning at all. Ah, I'm trying to regret my decision. No, wait. Okay. okay. I just want to wish I had the choice to talk to these people. Because I'd rather, like, conversation be going on the entire time. That'd be nice. I wonder what oxen free means. You know, I do remember you from Mr. Tuttle's class. You sit in the, uh, back, behind Jake. I just forgot. I'm sorry. <coughs> oh, hey, it's, it's nothing to be sorry about. I don't talk all that much, so I don't know why you'd remember me. I'm also just, like, never there. It's a loophole where I don't know if you know this, but if you ditch, you get a detention, and if you don't go to that, you get suspended. But suspensions are like paid vacation, you can just do your work over. So... It's like, what's the point? Wait, if you don't really go to, like, class, what are you doing instead all day? Jenny, the TA, she lets me practice ballet in her studio. So that, really. Oh, and 
don't tell anyone, but my birthday's in three days, and I'm having a thing, and you're invited. Okay. I think Carissa's out of town, so... Well, happy early birthday! In my family, we celebrate birthdays all week, so you're four days late. You gotta get in the mind state. Thanks. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't even know why I brought it up. That's not true. I was thinking about... Uh, well, I'm worried about Clarissa and... Well, I was thinking about my last birthday when... No. Actually, sorry. Never mind. This has nothing to do with anything. I'm just in a fog right now. No, come on. I want to hear this. It was last year. I'm oh, sorry. I'm just going to check which way I need to go. Your birthday. Go. Just this was when Nicole was in her car accident, and so of course we cancel and go visit her. And I'm not going to pout about that. Cool. It's common decency. It's fine. But afterwards, after this totally emotionally draining night, Clarissa still came over and surprised me with this huge cake. And we stayed up and watched all my favorite movies. Wait, Clarissa did that? Clarissa. Our Clarissa. She's a good person. Alex, really. It's just... It's like she's had a pebble in her boot for a while that she just can't seem to get rid of. Anyways, my birthday's in three days, and I just hope she's okay. That's all. Don't worry, Nona. Clarissa's uh, around here somewhere.
the music. No, oh, never mind. about that. That was a detour that was not necessary. I didn't realize what we were going to say, what path we were going on until like I was pretty much all the way there. I thought it was one of those off-beaten paths that I could find a little stack of rocks to tune into. So, my bee, my bee, it's all good. What? Why did the music come back for a few seconds and then go away? Why are you booming like that? So, it's the Parks and Facilities Building. That's down a bit, right? I think so. If I'm remembering the right building, I don't think it's far. Yeah, we're, we're close. I actually don't know, I just said that. I really could get in the habit of reading the other responses or just reading. I pretty much have only been reading two and then choose whichever is best between the two. And then like because I feel like if I take my time to read the third one, then I don't have time anything. So I just don't want that to happen. Clarissa! What are you... How did she get up there? Clarissa, where have you been? The last time we saw you jumped out a window. I, I mean, I thought... We thought you were dead. You don't know about that. Is there, is there a, something like... Oh, whoa, what the... Clarissa! What? Uh, Alex! Christ, the what's Dren wrong with her? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Clarissa, can you... Can you hear me? Oh god, not again. Uh, I hate when this happens. Alex, uh, please, can you just... I don't know what you can do, but can you just do something? Please, just try anything. Like... Uh, I can... Uh, I'll try, okay, I'll try. Clarissa, can you? Can you hear me? Alex, come on, just please try and get her down, at least, please, somehow. Clarissa, can you come down? Uh, she just looks awful.
barely holding on to our... What more can you do? You can do your job. That's just for starters. You can be what you signed up for. When you're off, the little machine has no more heart than a brain. No more heart than... Is she... okay, or... She's... I think so. Oh, Carissa, are you okay? You scared the crap out of us. I'm fine. I can... I'm fine. What? Okay. Are you sure? Do you remember anything that happened? I remember... waiting in Fort Milner... and seeing you. That was a while ago. How did I get here? You don't remember how you got here? Clarissa, you were dead a minute ago. Do you, do you realize that? Nora doesn't know about that. We saw your body, no joke. Really? Okay, well, I'm alive now, so hallelujah. She doesn't even care! So, you're just blank. No, I remember something. I remember you, with that radio. What? And I remember feeling like you were the reason all of this was happening. Me? What did I do? Wait, it's Clarissa's turn already? What yeah, happened? it's my turn. What do you mean, it's Clarissa's turn already? Oh, no. I haven't even asked one question. Wait, what's what's going on? We're back at the... What? It's Clarissa's turn? Yeah, it's Clarissa's turn. And you, of all people, should know what my question is going to be, because I'm not going to waste it. Alex, what did you do? Explain why me and my best friend... Clarissa, please don't draw a chalk line here. Don't make factions, just... We have to stick together if we're gonna make it through this. Yeah. Jonas, now you're seeing who you're stuck to until graduation. Get away from him. Clarissa, seriously, I can vouch for this. This isn't her fault. It has to be her fault. Of course it's her fault. Why is... There's no other way this story goes. Why? Why does it have to be my fault? Why does it have to be your fault? Are you kidding me? Yeah. No, come on, Clarissa. Let's not do this right now. You're gonna learn, Jonas. I swear to God, the town looks at her like she has a red letter tattooed on her frickin' forehead. Why? Clarissa. And the giant, lit up, Christmas tree reason why is that Michael is dead because of her. What? Because of her. It would take a very sick person to see it that way, and I would love to hear the explanation. Michael was gonna leave town. He was free, he was out of here, until Austin this one free. convinced him to take her swimming for one last God knows what. What do you mean? What does that have anything? And he drowned. He drowned in Horn Lake while this one could barely flap her arms. It doesn't make it my fault! Anyone could have been there, anyone, and then they would have had to watch him die, you unbelievable prick! Yeah. I don't know why those letters Anyone were wouldn't have watched him die, Alex. Anyone else would have done something. Okay, I'm sorry, but enough. Clarissa, that's enough. 
It's too much right now. I can't... I can't believe... Ugh. Nona, it was... awful, all right? It, it's still awful, and, and I... Yeah. I don't... just... Alex, this is none of my business, okay? None. I didn't realize I was directing it at her. But we came here to do a thing, and that thing is gonna get us home. A thing. So, let's get home. No. Uh, Carissa, what are you... All the outs and free. Outs and free? Uh -huh. Hey, whoa. Man, do you ever... Do you ever get deja vu? Jeez, I just got a serious thing of goosebumps from one. Uh, I guess you don't remember, like, anything that just happened, right? Um, to what anything are you referring? Yeah. Exactly. Uh, Clarissa being possessed and shrieking at me would probably be the big kahuna here. I, huh, I sorta can picture Clarissa being like weird or something, but I don't know, it's kind of a blur to be honest. Can I get another response? Okay, well, the office that we gotta try to get into is like right there. So let's try and whatever our way in. I guess. We're gonna try we're gonna try to get Yep, this isn't budging. I just was, you know, um, I don't know about that. I think, yeah, I think we can just bust our way through, honestly. Bust our way through? What do you mean? Yeah. Bust our way through? What is that supposed to mean? Wow, speaking my mind. I think we should try it. Okay. Cross your fingers and hold your thumbs. Where'd she go? Okay. Uh, I think here's something. It's another pocket radio, I think. But it, it's like there's way more stations on the dial. Ooh, neato. Here's another one. It says... Their wall radios? Wave assisted lock? Whatever that means. Oh, duh. It says right here that each frequency is like a key to open the doors around here. What? Wow. So they're like ID tags or something. Really? How does it work? Like you just turn into the signal at one of the lockboxes and you're in, I think. Ooh, wait, wait, here's like a, wait, what is this? India, Quebec, uniform, echo. Personal effects of Margaret Dorothy Adler. Why would her stuff be here? Didn't her family, or, like, hasn't her family been carting her things back to town? No, we can start back. I just wanna... Okay, here. Uh, to whom... What? What? Who is should concern? Why did it do that? This I island, and its history, is a lie. Jeez. Mm. She didn't have fond memories of this place, did she? What, what, what is that? Who, who's it for? To whom it should concern. It says right here. Oh. I have been compelled by both forces outside of my control and my own willful concern for the safety of others to conceal the many truths about Edwards Island. Oh. Isn't that 
music. But now I feel any further inaction. Forces outside her control. The like like ghosts or the army or what was she talking about? Let me finish then. <laughs> Inside, you'll find two wall-equipped radios. I have commandeered the old Cardinal Station 140.1 and used it to relay clues to the nearby beacons buried throughout the area. Okay. Find these beacons and the notes within. Oh, scavenger hunt! Oh, scavenger hunt, scavenger hunt. <laughs> Originally, I wasn't going to reply. <laughs> wait, <finish>. wait. <laughs> to whosoever finds the material, know that I'm discomfited in keeping it hidden and ashamed for the lies I help preserve. Okay. But also know that I acted in what I felt were the best interests for all at the time. Okay. And truly, for the interest of time itself. Margaret Adler. Hmm. Weird lady. Interesting. Is that it? Is that why we're stopping our conversation? Okay, what, but there were like three other things I was gonna look at here. Okay, and you're just gonna hold that letter for the rest of the time. So we're going. Okay. Steal a boat and leave. Should we go get everyone else first? I feel like. Why am I still looking down at the radio? I feel like we should get other people before we go get the boat. But I guess we need to know that we can get in to the place first. And then we'll go get everyone else. And then we'll be like, come on down. But the only thing is, I feel like there have been many times where we've come to things. Doors have been locked, gone away, unlocked. I feel like we work the other way around. Where it's unlocked one moment and then locked. And we come back to it, yeah. <sighs> oh my god. Okay. Well, I think that's possible. I said go to clip. I clicked on it. Freaking A. I have all these things written down on this post it note. I don't know if they're going to be important later, but I hope they are. All oh, my efforts have gone to waste. Uh, I'm eating mini m &Ms. The best kind of m and Shit, how am I gonna? <laughs> Alex, why are you wearing that jacket? It's like 75 degrees and the sun's out, you know? You're wearing- And I thought you said you were gonna go swimming anyway. What? The sun is not out. Oh. The sun is- I guess it- barely came out just now but see this is when i get punished for watching the weatherman he said it was going to be like overcast first i was there he said there was a chance for clouds hey michael we didn't bring drinks did we i thought we said we'd bring drinks We didn't bring drinks? You didn't bring drinks. Oh, poo. Today turned out to be a flawless day. It really did. Yeah, no, it did. It really did. No. I wanted to bring a kite, but thought you'd laugh at me. Uh, yeah. Um, it really is kind of ideal, actually. Yeah, I'm like, right about to start sweating, but I'm not. No, it is 
perfect ice cream and tennis weather. That is rare. I didn't do anything, according to Clara. It's been a spell since we did something, right? I feel like I haven't talked to you in a while. How have you been? What's been going on? How's classes? How's... What's his face? Mr. Collins' English. Truthfully, I've, um... I've... Ah, sorry. I think... Yeah, I... <laughs> I accidentally left my phone on the ferry, because I do things like that. <laughs> oh, God, you idiot. Go get it before it leaves. When I get back, I want to hear an Alex story. <laughs> okay, I guess. So... Uh, <laughs> I don't think um, I'm glad we could all do stuff today. I'm glad you were cool with it, I mean. I know you guys are really close and like... I know it can be annoying when somebody starts keeping all their time for their girlfriend or whatever. So, I think it would be cool if we could, like, continue to do things together. Yeah, I uh, totally understand. And yeah, let's uh, do stuff, you know. Cool, cool. Michael, uh... He loves you, like, a lot. I'm sure you know that, but he talks about you all the time. So sweet. <laughs> oh, Alex did this, and... Yeah, well, I love him too. I had to fight the skipper for it, but he didn't reckon how many squats I could do. <laughs> What's it up to, six? Only on burrito days. So, apparently, you love me. Is that right? Well, if I don't, I don't know why I got you that skateboard for your birthday. You skate? Not yet. Yeah, and the no helmet part kind of sends a message, right? I'm not one for subtlety. So, I actually really want a cold something, so I'm gonna run into town and get like a soda. That's where it happens. Anybody want anything? Um... Uh, oh, good. yeah. Get me a drink, too? Sure. I'll be back. I don't know if that affects anything. Okay, I'm here. What's the story? I want the news. I want the Alex first edition. What's going on? I'm, uh, doing all right. Yeah? I guess. I, I don't know. Okay. Maybe you'll tell me what it is later. And look, I know this was supposed to be our day, but I completely forgot I promised Clarissa I'd do something with her, so thanks for chaperoning. I know it's not what you had in mind, so... Yeah, no problem. Just don't get all smoochy-smooch while I'm in the general vicinity. I don't want to get all... <laughs> because know, that would ever happen. The future into the past, it's important to me that you like Clarissa, Alex, so... Tell me the truth. What do you really think of her? Stick with it. Stay with her. If she makes you happy, if That's she makes you laugh, who am I to say anything yeah. otherwise? Thank you. Good blessings, <laughs> good tidings. You know, I never noticed. That's a good-looking jacket. I should ask for it back. I don't like my new one. 
Feels like I got shoes on my arms or something. <laughs> you know what, Bucko? I need it more than you. <laughs> Bucko, you haven't called me that in years. Alex, are you... All right, are you back with me now? Man, you've been acting like a... I don't even know how to put it, like a bird, just flitting around in circles for ten minutes. I was about to, like, slap you or scream or something. It's been not fun to watch in light of everything. Nona, I, I just saw... I think I just saw my brother Mike. What? How? Where? Here? Is he... Was it like a... I don't... I don't know what to call it. A vision? I was... Uh, it was like those time jumps we're sometimes having, right? This was... It's like we've been having ripples, and this was a wave. I was bumped all the way back to when Michael was still alive. Right now? Well, not right now, obviously. Wait. Wait, what? She said, like, right now. Wait, what did I say? I didn't know Maggie grew up in Maine. Oh. There's a similar statue... Statute of a soldier in Maine where I grew up. My memory of it is... I, I think part of the reason why... Wait. The memory of it is... Uh, bah, bah, bah. Let's start over. There's a similar... Statue of a soldier in Maine where I grew up. My memory of it is, I think, part of the reason why I said yes when the army recruited me out of college, despite my family's pr protestations. Anna, my closest friend from childhood, was of course thrilled at the possibility of my escape. I anonymously started the petition in 1975 to have this one made. After the daughter of Kanaloa, <laughs> crewman Francis Salter asked um, I don't know why a marker maybe for the hope I had I once had to help people what is that what does that mean was I there before we're going back into town what's happening where are we Wait, what? How did we get back over here? Why'd you say that my girl is Not my girl, sorry. Hey, why aren't you at the tower? This one got a little antsy. Weird stuff was playing on the radio. That voice said I had a mother's laugh. What does that even mean? Anyways, are we happy? We are happy. We got a new radio that's supposed to open doors and gates in some magical way. Oh, thank God. I was getting nervous that you would have walked all that way and then not found anything. Seeing as how it was my advice to uh, do the whole thing. How have um, you two been? What am I working with here? How much leering am I going to have to put up with? No, well, I'm glad we can leave. Let's put it that way. Yeah, don't even tiptoe in the vicinity of a joke right now. I just want to get out of here. Well, if the radio's the thing... It doesn't matter without Clarissa. Do I really have to point out that she's not here? Oh, yeah, that's... Yeah, should we maybe look for her, possibly? Even if the boat plan works, we shouldn't leave her here. Listen, if we have the key, which is apparently this radio, then let's just go to the house and see. And if it looks like we can leave that way, then we'll go on a Clarissa hunt. <sighs> All right. I think you're supposed to use the radio to tune into the gate, right, Alex? I guess the radio will open this somehow? Hopefully. Give it a whirl. Okay. 
Please have a boat. Please have a boat. Please have a boat. Just think happy thoughts. Yeah, happy thoughts. That house is huge. That lady really knew how to live. It's like the Chateau de Adler. Ah, oh, she does have a boat. Yeah, see? Allie knew what she was talking about. Allie? She should, anyway. I mean, she had to schlep back and forth here all summer. Oh. Something in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Huh. Ren, you were right. There's like a ledger here. The Adler family does own the island. And here's a combination for a padlock to a ah. chest, is all it says. 29, 18, 
54. 29, 18, 54. A chest? Have you seen one yet? 29, 18, 54. I think that's what happened. <sighs> Negative, but maybe I just missed it. She made a lot of... What should I call these slides? They're they're not videos. Um, silent memories? Yeah. Why would you want to enter your basement from the outside of your house? Oh. Oh, it's like a it's like a boat that needs keys. There are no oars. And before we go crazy, it's not... It wasn't with Maggie's stuff back at the office, like with the radio? No. We looked through all of her stuff, I think. Huh. Well, uh... What's plan B if we can't... The keys, they... They have to be in the house. For the movers or her family, you know? That's as good a guess as any. It's a radio lock. The woman sure did love her antiquated security. Is a nifty gizmo. That's right, I went the other way. Answer Zemo. <laughs> Finally, Carissa, oh, God, Jesus. You scared me. Oh my Thought you were like gosh. Maggie Adler's dead body or something. Clarissa, where have you been? After we saw you in town, you just. Hey, I could ask you the same thing. It was like I sneezed and you were gone. I ended up in the fields and just decided to come here and like wait it out. I haven't seen anybody since, so I thought I'd camp it up. Uh, and then how'd you get past the gate? It's like a slab of wrought iron. It looked impossible to climb. Well, apparently it's not that impossible since, you know, I'm here. I thought you hated physical activity. Uh, not when my life's in peril. Christ. Look, Clarissa's here, so everyone's here now. We can just... everyone's okay, all right? That's a good thing. Yeah, let's just... Find the keys to the boat, or a phone, or whatever, and just find a way home. I promise, we can all keep talking and or fighting at school on Monday. Fine. Okay, let's focus up. Everybody find something and hope that it helps. Man, she owned enough books. It's mostly math, I think. Ergodic thermodynamics. And religion, sheesh, there's okay, a lot Okay, of... we get it. She liked the smell of paper. Fascinating insight. We'll all miss- I'm not talking to you. I'm just talking out loud. You can only ever talk out loud. Ugh. How are you doing? How are you doing? Look, Jonas, are we, like, okay? I mean, because of the whole taking not you to town thing. I'm not gonna pretend it didn't bother me a little, but it'd be stupid to, like... Tonight has been bad enough. I'm not gonna crab about that. I mean, are you, like, mad at me or something? No, no, we're... I wanna be okay with you. I just... If we keep at each other's throats, I don't know if I'll be able to make it through the night. Me neither. So let's just not be at each other's throats anymore. There. Just See? Easy. Sounds like a little, you know. 
Oh, that's an attic? Thought it was like a cat's toy or something. Wanna come up? Yeah, sure. Ooh, you know what? This might be the, um, the chest that takes that combination. 29, 18, 54. It's a lot of radios and those containers we saw at the town office. Oh, and like a map of the caverns. She's written here, tune into the source. What do you think that means? She couldn't have known about the ghosts, right? Tune into the source. It, it's probably something about the special radios, you know? Huh. Is this... Ah, the boat keys. Got him. Perfecto. All right, we got keys for the boat. Where? Show you. <laughs> Clarissa, what's going on? You're confused, aren't you? Well, you should be. How does it go? Things are different except in a different way? <laughs> Just come downstairs so we can get started. Nona, are you okay? Wait, wake up! I don't want to go downstairs. Ren, are you are you all right? We're in a we're in a time loop thing. No, I'm not going in the freaking the mirror. The mirror. Come on, Jonas. I I really need you. Don't blank out on me now. There you are. Oh my God. Now we imagine you're a bit confused. But don't fret. This will be the final part of your training, Alex. All training is supervised by very skilled instructors. Training? I, I don't want to be trained. What are you... You signed up for this, Alexandra. So please, I cannot bear your excuses, offspring. You How was I meant to know what the hell was going to happen? And yet, without, without understanding, understanding your footing, you still acted. Don't, don't worry. worry. The test is easy. We will speak of something we see in the and you will go and find it. See? As simple and good humor as, as your mother's, mother's apple pie. What is it with you guys and all the, the games? You're like dogs or children. Just what is the point? The point, dear, the point is that they were never games, and you can figure that out by your lonesome. Now, let's start with the softball. I spy, with my little eye, radiation. There is, of course, a time limit here. So, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Once they call the fish alive. Four, three, two, one. The poor thing's life had just begun. Oh, I'm sorry, child. You weren't even close. Stop it! Come on! No, it's it's my fault. I, I didn't Look know. Look at that. The little one. Where is she? Where'd you take her? Don't you mind? But let this be a teachable moment for you. If you paid attention, you'd have noticed the television set right by my side, the little X-ray emitting death machine. But right now, you'd be wise to think of radiation in another sense. Pay attention. What are you even talking about right now? I spy with my little eye a notch. Let's make this a little harder, okay? Eight. Uh, is it the... the... 
This painting, it looks kind of like a knot. Excellent, excellent. You're doing so well. It's time for the bonus round, Alex, so stay quick. This is one you'll really want to find. I spy with my little eye a picture of a memory. Be fast now. Five little ducks went out one day. Over the hills and far away. Mommy duck called quack, quack, quack. But four, three, no, two, what? one. No little ducks came quacking back. Oh, not good. Not good at all. Clarissa, please, fight whatever this is and stop this. Come on. Silly boy. Fig leaf away. Stop doing that. They haven't done anything. I'm just... I'm just not doing well. Then take it as encouragement to do well. What you fail to find is a photograph of Margaret Adler and her friend Anna. You see, you and your schoolyard chums are experiencing... Well, this has sort of happened before. Maggie and Anna tried to sport with us many years ago and, well, only one survived. But in the process, we discovered a way for us to return, so to speak. It just takes a little time. Okay, if we- if I help you, will you stop whatever it is that you're doing with my friends? Ah, uh, well... There's the rub. They're not, not an eternal, eternal recurrence. recurrence. The waves. It's the waves, we think. And we will use the waves to absorb into your friends so as sunlight blooms into flowers. And we will grow. And we will engulf. Wait, what... what happens to them after you're... absorbed? Their form will exist with us inside. It will be a swap, you see, of... essences, I guess you could call them. We tried it too quickly with Anna, but now we know to wait and soak. We had to keep you here, on the island. And it will be a great honor, Alex, really, to carry us through this life. And on to the next. You... you had your time. You had your time. Don't take ours just because you had some... some accident. We never had our time. It was ripped from us. We watched the universe's conception fly to its demise over and over and over again. When our vessel dashed on our rocks, we had it until dawn. And so are you. We would spend our time wisely. We thank you for your good service. influence Michael. He can live his own life. Okay, seriously, who are you? So we can go on. <laughs> I, I think I'm gonna be sick. Me first. Uh, it wasn't a dream or a vision or something. You and Clarissa standing in the living room just now, was it? Ugh. Ah, no. But I wish it was a dream. Usually there's a lot more talking horses. 
Christ, I felt like I was, like I was dying. Alex, how hard is it to find an old woman's junk within a reasonable time frame? Yeah, that did not feel good. Normally, she's gonna... It was much harder than it looked, trust me. So, I mean, Christ, if Clarissa was whisked away to the cave by nuclear submarine monsters, then... I mean, the plan has to be to retrieve her, right? I'm still going to call them ghosts, if that's okay. A ghost? It... Marissa is only like one slice of the problem. We're all infected or whatever, so we need to rip the issue off like a bandage all at once. Okay, great, yeah, but how do we do that? Well, uh, good question. Maggie? I think Maggie Adler might have had some sort of a plan or a, a scheme or something to fix what's going on. What possible plan could Maggie Adler have? First of all, she's dead. And second of all, she was like the island mother- She left secret notes all over the place. The ghosts hate her. She was involved with it somehow. Come on. And she thought she needed to tune a radio into the- the source of the problem in the cave. Well, if we're going to the cave... Oh, actually, I forgot. I saw the entrance has been caved in since you guys went inside. All right, Wonderful. I know there are a whole bunch of secret communist bomb-fearing tunnels dug into this place during the 1950s. And Maggie has loads of film about military stuff in her basement, so... Maybe there's a way back into the cave through one of those, you're thinking? <sighs> Let's take a look. <laughs> what kind of name is a Fippany Fields anyway? Wait, is it a Fippany? It's Epiphany Field. Oh, that makes more sense. Careful, that film's really flammable. Wouldn't want Smoke and Johnny to light the house on fire. Ha ha. All right, there's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Awesome. Oh man, if this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos. Yeah. I'm sure this is just the, uh... God, oh. it's just the first thing. Just give it a second to warm up, will you? You can... Okay, we're getting warmer, I think. So, if you look at the, like, lines or whatever, the bomb shelter should lead right into the cave, just like from another angle. Sure. According to this, at least. Oh, so it does. But how do we get in? Isn't that a pretty fundamental flaw here? Oh, what? She knew about these things? Wow, that's crazy. 
It says that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the cave, we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself? Okay, but we're not doing that, right? Good question. Yeah, that's... that's going a little above. Above and beyond. Well, I don't know what to tell you, but strap in, boys and girls, because we might have to, okay? If it's the only thing that will fix us. Yeah, yeah but that's, like, scary. We'll, well something better scary. work. Okay. Or we're boned. Or we're boned. Precisely. Oh, Dude, sorry, this is like, this. this looks like the end, but from the, from the wrong film thing. No, 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 wait. This is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing, because it, like, sounded so weird. It's called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is what? showing us how to do it. See? It says, when someone sends an emergency signal oh from the Catbird station in the woods, and the receiving station confirms it. It's like a connected mm. response thing. Brilliant! Really? It's good enough for me. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part. You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. All right, break. And if anything goes wrong, please don't tell me. I won't want to know. Same here. I don't want to know nothing. Now I should be able to. Look. They're walking mighty slow, just cause it's downhill, kids. Don't need to worry about tripping that fine. But didn't it have like the response thing had like a triangle, so have calls coming from different areas, right? <sighs> okay, okay, okay. <sighs> Saving. Okay. So, now the game has saved. Um, I will be exiting. Are we going to talk at all a little bit? Maybe? Okay. So. This has been tons of fun so far. One second, I just need to make sure this is the same. Okay, just need to make sure. So, that was a lot of fun. A very interesting story going on so far. I'm really excited to get down to what exactly it is, because at one point I think that Jonas is going to see his mom or something, because that, like, my reflection, like the first one I saw, was like, make sure you let Jonas talk to his mom. So, that's something. So... Tomorrow, I'll probably try and finish this because it seems really interesting. Depends on how long it takes, honestly, because I feel like we're pretty far in, but then I looked at the letters, and I feel like the letters is like the second half, so I feel like there's a still that whole second half to go. So, we'll find out tomorrow. But yeah, so... See you kids tomorrow. Bye.